I'm very happy to be here in Katowice and um, I had this opportunity to perform uh, and record this amazing piece by Krzysztof Wołek, uh, Open Close. It's a very demanding piece for the bass clarinet uh, because uh, uh, Krzysztof uh, put inside of the score in the solo part um, almost all the possibilities of the instrument. And actually he stretched also not only the, the instrument uh, itself but also the uh, the musicians as a soloist, uh, I was forced to, uh, to, to find all the possible colors that uh, are inside of the bass clarinet. And um, not only this, uh, we, ha we had also a lot of chats mm, during the time when he was composing it. We were talking about uh, different sounds, uh, probably coming also from his own uh, experience with the electronic music, I think. And uh, you can even perceive it that the, the timbre of the instrument um, is so colored, just like electronic music. And um, the orchestration, of course, is really um, classical, so to say. But uh, for example, he put uh, many extended techniques, both in the orchestra and in the bass clarinet. Now, another special thing is the use of a very special uh, plastic reed for the clarinet, which is um, and the normal B flat clarinet, which comes inside of the of the piece quite at the end and then uh, the bass clarinet comes back but then during this very special part uh, the, the normal clarinet so to say is, uh, has a very destroyed sound given by this uh, very special reed which is made of plastic and which produces uh, really interesting uh, uh, noises not really sounds. Um, of course it's the first time I collaborate with uh, Krzysztof and it's a big honor because he's a uh, Actually, a composer I really admire. But it's not the first time that I'm here to perform with um, Shimon Vivales and the Orchestra Musik Novi. Uh, we played many times together, actually. We, we did also an, an important CD for me, uh, for my career, for the Decca cl Classics. And uh, we recorded um, and we played uh, Brian Fernihaug, La Chute de Car, which is a very demanding piece for clarinet and ensemble. And then we played also other pieces, uh, Michel Vadera, and um, so it's a long time story <laughs> between me and uh, Shimon and uh, the whole uh, ensemble, which is, I must say, I'm, I play um, almost everywhere, and, uh, but I'm, I really enjoy each time I come back to Poland because of this uh, fantastic heart that you have, and uh, I really perceive it when I play it, and it's always positive. Anyways, just to come back to the piece, um, um, it's a quite demanding piece, but uh, in the end, uh, the result for me is really natural. And uh, I think uh, Krzysztof could uh, find uh, the right way to use the, the bass clarinet in its uh, entire possibilities. And uh, now I can say that this uh, clarinet concerto, so to call it uh, bass clarinet concerto, is a really unique piece in the clarinet um, uh, repertoire. 